About 15 years ago, my husband and I went back to Indiana from our other businesses and decided to help out our, his parents in the funeral home. And I realized that there was a real need. I started hearing about celebrants, and I just realized there was a real need for these people that were coming in and didn't know who they wanted to have. You know, working in the funeral home, seeing too many funerals that people come away from, and they're like, I don't want to do that. I'm a grief facilitator at the funeral home. Lost my own son in 2001, and um, didn't have a very good service for him. And when I saw information about celebrants, I thought, this is what everybody deserves, a good service. My own father's funeral was one of those Catholic masses that was very cookie cutter. His name was inserted and indeed mispronounced. And it broke my heart that the priest did not get to elaborate or no one was given the opportunity to elaborate on uh, his role as a World War II hero and his role as a uh, drummer in a lot of the big bands that came into Boston in the 40s and 50s. So um, I really thought stories are out there that need to be told. I just like to help people that are grieving and, and I felt like the celebrant training was part of that process. I first um, really felt drawn to try to help families going through loss when uh, one of my nieces died and um, I began to look for ways that I might could be helpful because the mortuary and that event was very helpful to our family. We felt like they went beyond the call of duty. so. A friend of mine who had been to the celebrant training called me and said, hey, I found something that might be what you're looking for. I think what attracted me most to the concept of the celebrant was the increase in your listening skills uh, when you're meeting with families and being able just to pick up on those little tweaks that would maybe make that special service you know, a little bit better. I love what I do as a funeral director but I also love what I do as a celebrant. It gives me the privilege to know my families, to share their grief with them, but to share their joys, because when they tell the stories, there's a joy in that story. There might be some tears that come along, but still there's a joy and the idea of knowing that, that the celebrant, whoever they are, takes a personal interest in their loved one and that they're going to recognize them and give them a fitting tribute that they deserve.